Smell like they'd been sniffed. <laughs> so good. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. We are here in Paradise, Jimmy Land. We don't have the rain today, so it's gonna be fun time and hopefully be able to catch some big bass with Jimmy Houston. That doesn't sound very bad at all, does it? Eh, I think it's gonna be a fun day. Check out the water from the rain, all the rain we had. I figured it might murky it up, but no. It's not murky because it has gorgeous grass in it. And I was also looking for Lucy. She's the star deer around here and she sleeps on the back deck and I just found her. So she just, uh, she's just waking up for the morning. So before we get to fishing, let's go say hi to Lucy. Good morning. Good morning, Lucy. How are you? Good morning. So she uh, she sleeps out here on this this little bedding. This is an area where deer can come and sleep and feel safe. How are you doing this morning? Are you doing good? Are you doing good? Yeah, you're shedding. You're shedding, girl. She'll literally just go up to the windows. Jimmy makes her breakfast feeds it to her in a bowl, it is incredible. And she had a little mishap. She got caught in a in a fence or something. And so she's got a she's got a couple battle scars, but y'all petting a deer. It's just a weird feeling. Okay Lucy. You wanna go fishing? You wanna go fishing today? Yeah? She's all about it. Look at that tongue action. I'm gonna go get some tackle ready. Whenever you're ready you just hoof up and come on over, okay? Is this the horse we're riding in on right here? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take this mule here. Okay. Going fishing with the man himself, <laughs> Jimmy Houston. We are going catching. We're not just going fishing. We're going catching. Now, that's pretty brazen to say something like that when uh, we've got big rain come in here. Now we got bluebird skies. Everybody says it's the worst kind of day. We're going to take the worst kind of day and make it the best kind of day. I love that attitude. Exactly what we're going to do. <laughs> he is positive all the time. Did Every you? day is going to be a great one. Every day. Did you feed Lucy this morning? I fed Lucy oh, this okay. morning. She got her Cheerios and carrots and grapes and bread and uh, vanilla cookies. I walk in the woods and I don't see her around. I just go start walking in the woods and pretty soon she shows up. She's right there with me. Oh, Otters. I'm not buckled up. That's why I'm dinging. Yeah, you're dinging. I'm, I'm... I just thought you was a little dingy. I don't oh, have to worry okay. about it. It's kind of like going fishing. We're going fishing in a little dingy. These are ran dingy ranch road laws, foot. people. <laughs> ranch road laws. You have this lake out here that uh, one of them the dam busted on. Right. Back in 2015. 2015. So five or six years past that now. Then that one's coming back. We caught some good fish out of that yesterday. This one we're going to today is uh, it's a bit older. There's some bigger fish in it. Yeah, Bill, it Technically. does it does have I, I caught an eleven pounder out of it this year and we might catch a really giant fish today, obviously. But uh, I built this lake in two thousand three two thousand five. It was actually two thousand seven before we got finally got full of water. It's pretty low right now. We haven't had much rain and uh, yet for this this year's rain we got about an inch, a little over an inch, inch three yesterday. But uh, but the lake will come up, we get these spring rains, but it's down kinda low, but one of the things that I've always liked about fishing lakes when they're a little bit low is the fish didn't have near, near as many places uh -huh. to hide. Uh -huh. Some of their hiding places is dry land, so they got they got to be in the water. This is, this is a dream come true, y'all. I know that's a cliche, but literally me and my dad growing up watching <laughs> Jimmy on TV and, you know, uh, hey, sugar boo, come here. You know, I mean, <laughs> all of that. And now I'm going fishing with Jimmy today. You know, awesome. we've been doing that show for 45 years, and... You, you'll remember this sometime down through the down the road. You'll remember me telling you this, but it just seems like that we just started this television show 
yesterday and I can remember some of the early deals and all the early trials and tribulations and getting the television show started and of course that was way back before things like YouTube and Facebook right. and Instagram yeah. and all the stuff that uh, is a is a big part of media today and and unfortunately we television is still a big part of media but uh, you know if somebody would have said do you think there's any possibility that you'll be doing this 45 years from now and go not, not a chance not a chance and uh, but it happens it happens in a hurry but you know when you spend 45 years running around the country fishing and meeting all the great people you get to meet and fish with uh, it's just like a blessing you talk about attitude it's like a blessing every single day every single day well you've had one heck of a life in the fishing industry speaking, oh, speaking, oh, oh, speaking we, elk, oh here they are elk. one on the outside he's visiting over here saying why don't y'all open that gate let me in there wow the one on the out, the, it might be the opposite all those on the inside might be look how big they are isn't that isn't, they're just such huge animals they're horses look at, look at this big cow right here is the second one she is so big and yet they can they can they can run through the woods with the big racks these are all cows I saw a, a young bull the other day, a five by five. I still had his horns left over from last year. You see the baby over there on the other side? You just barely, oh, listen, barely listen, see listen, the baby. Yeah. He's barely oh. see. Oh. Oh. Get, get out of Dodge. <laughs> <laughs> Blown away. Cool. I mean, starting the morning off with some elk. There's some white tail over there. Deer. Saw a turkey this morning. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. You're talking about a wild. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. You are a wild turkey. Yeah, sometimes. This is the Jimmy Rig right here. We are ready to rock and roll. Got a very good rain. Everything's wet, but everything will dry out in this wind, I promise you. We can get across on that wall over on that other side and get out of a lot of this wind. One of the reasons we'll get out of a lot of the wind is pretty chilly. That wind's cold this morning. Doesn't sound good when it starts. It does that spinning and cranks up. It's just telling the fish, I'm here. I'm here to play. You can you can swim, but you can't hide. Especially with live scope. I might go see if we can find a bunch of crappie right off the bat. We might, I, might, I want to go look in one little place. I love it. I know you. I know I you love, love it. Excellent eating. Yeah, that too. Nobody gets mad at you if you fillet a bunch of them. I know. <laughs> Golden Krispies. That is the way to start, my friend. <laughs> that is the way to start. Look at that beautiful Buddy, sugar bugger, Jimmy. Back in the boat. Big YouTube guy. I'm a big YouTube guy. I got a video. Oh, man. That's our first fish of the day, and that is exactly the way to start. That that fish on a jig looks like. Gotta love it. Ah, yes, sir. Can I give it a sniff, Jimmy? You could sniff that one. I'll, okay. I, I don't know. I, I've been kissing a few that smell like they'd been sniffed. <laughs> <sighs> so good. That's the way to start. Right? That is a good fish right there, man. Beautiful. Beautiful bass. Biggest fish I've caught so far this year has been on a jig. That one picked it up kind of funny. It started swimming towards the boat, and I had to catch up to it. Black and blue jig. I might have to. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Pretty baby doll! Pretty baby doll! Yeah! I, I think they smell like honeysuckle. Oh! I had that one just about four or five inches deep. That one was getting up on the bank. But anyway, I want to try. I want to make sure I had one of those new ones rolling. There's one. Oh, just a tasty one. No. When I first hooked it, it loaded up real nice, and I was like, oh. Yeah. Ate it. Yeah. He ate it. He had it down deep, didn't he? Well, that's not the 11 pounder I told you was right here in this spot. There is 11 pounder, isn't it? Not quite. That's her little boyfriend. Yeah, that was you know, on the St. Lawrence River. That's a public water. That's where all the fish in a couple of rivers that come in through the reservation here. Oh, God. Woo! 
Monkey, huh? They pulled it and bait now. Yeah. It did. They're doing that every time on the cross. You know, Jimmy said there's an 11 pounder in there, and I got a bite. I put the full, full hook set on it. That might have been it. <laughs> All right, sugar booger, I'm going. I'm coming for you. Got him. That's a big one. That's a big one. I'm serious. Well, no, it ain't no 11 powder. <laughs> oh, I thought that was the one, Jimmy. You have me going. It's a nice fish, but <laughs> you got me dreaming. I love it. Jimmy's got a tendency to do that. Get you hyped up. Love it. Not quite an 11. He could have been. Well, he might be something. But Jimmy's on her. A lot of people have caught 11 pounders. They just catch them when they, when they got there. Yeah, if it would have got off, you know, 10 feet from the boat, I would have told you. Definitely that 11 pounder. Oh my gosh, they're doing it again. I mean, just. There's another one. He's got it. Oh, man, they're do. He's got it again. Got him that time. Got him that time. It might be a lot of them. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Nice fish. Technically caught at this point, but. Just in case he gets off. But I, I like to sniff them. I like to get a little closer. Yeah. Mmm. That fish. Yeah, Jimmy might be right. There might be a few. There might be a few more in there. But it was a bam! Hit my bait. Yeah, you got three. Nothing. And then it, it swimming it back to make another cast. It hit it. Hit it again. So. The last two or three, I've, I've caught it. So. Beautiful. See ya. Alright, little update here. Oh, Pat. He's getting in the other boat. He's going to get some other wide shots. We got the Tucker boys over there and the old tracker. Alright, dude. Remember that just in case he fell in, bud. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. So tell tell me what, what we got going on here. What's the bite? We got so a good far? situation going on right here. He just in got in that tree back there and got three bites on one cast finally caught the fish on the third bite and then i told him i said that could be a big, big bunch of fish right there since you got three bites could have been the same fish yeah and now we've caught about what seven or eight out of that one tree yep. or right here in this area i've got a big football head jig on and and i'm i'm dropping it but it's three quarters so it gets you know we're only in 12 or 14 foot of water so so it gets to the bottom pretty quickly so i'm mostly swimming that thing and you know just kind of jigging it and swimming it and uh and most of them are biting that bait swimming as opposed to fishing it on the bottom or dropping like we do a normal jig. We're kind of switching fishing a, a bait, a jig that you fish on the bottom. We're kind of fishing it like a swim jig. Looks like a bluegill or crawfish. Yeah, now. it just looks like a blue fit, bluegill or a crawfish or shad. Uh, God, that one. Dad, oh. And they keep doing that little they do, yeah. pincher bite thing. Yeah, and that's, that's crazy right there. So there's like a wad of fish out there's, here, y'all. There's, there's there, and, and of course, what ha what's happened, and what happens when you have, when you have multiple fish at a big school like that, is when you catch them, they're like chickens. They follow the other ones, and they end up a lot of times, they end up a lot of, a yeah. lot of times being out here around your boat, close <laughs> to your boat. Look at that. Ah, that's a catch. Caught. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. God, I like boat. the Jimmy rule. But, I love the Jimmy rule. <laughs> So we're All just going to keep flashing. your barb down. That's a barbless hook rule. So true. Can't do it if you got live hooks. It's getting kind of miserably low. Ooh. Just that bass on there. My trigger went off. Go ahead. Go ahead. You can hold it. I was going to try to snipe that one from you. Yeah, you can hold it. Oh, he's still following it. He's still following it. That's the bee. You got to be. He ought to eat. Figure eight it. He ought to eat your swim bait. He ought to eat it. There, there it goes. Goes. No. There it goes. Oh, man. I wonder, I wonder if that one's on a bed or something. That acts like it doesn't. Yeah. 
drop back. Oh, there's the one in that tree. It's not gonna get a tree. Yeah. There was uh there was another one about that size that chased my jig just a second ago. Did that one or? I missed that one. I was earlier. No. No. It was a single. I'll hold your spot. That's just beautiful hooked right in the schnoz right there. That's a good fish. Oh. Perfect. Perfect right at the top. Just of the perfect head. fat belly. Gotta love it. Man, Jimmy, you got some healthy ones. Very healthy. Beautiful. Uh, it's, it's been a long time since I've watched fish hit it in clear water. Little flat runners. 42. Close enough. Close enough. Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I think we're going to cross. Maybe not. Got him. That's a good one. Man, they're all up on this flat. Oh, that one's got a little black spot on its lip. Mm -hmm. Little dot. Okay, I see the edge of the pond here. Oh, there. Got it. Got it. Runner. Oh. Mm. That's a fighter. Come here. He's aiming for that. Oh, oh yeah. He's aiming for that. He was. He was trying to get there. We caught 41, 42. I think it's 43. That's another one with a black spot on its lip. Well, right I like there. the idea that it's a healthy fish, because that's a healthy fish. That is like super that. healthy. Oh, that's a good up there for me. I'll buy it. That one that was caught, that you had up there on that tree when your bait was on on that tree, mm -hmm. that, uh, that fish just came up and you caught it from behind. Oh, there's I think they got it. Up there in the dirt. As soon as we hit the water. That was in the dirt, man. It's a decent one. Pretty fish. Look at that. Looks like he, he's like he was sitting there with his mouth open. Just yes. boom, I mean, up there in like a foot of water. Oh, man, I don't know if I can lift you. You got a big belly. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. Mmm. Thick. That's nice. Love to see it. <laughs> Woo! Gotta love it. Man, this is so much fun, Jimmy. Oh, my gosh, y'all. We've well, got on a little bite here. And it is just fun, fun, fun. Can't stop Jimmy, though. Can't stop Jimmy. He's the Energizer Bunny. He won't quit fishing. Everybody's trying to go in for lunch. He's like, no, I'm going to catch a big one here on this point. I, I have a feeling he does that every day, Pat. <laughs> Probably does. Incredible day. We're going to go in, get a little bite to eat, then we're going to come back out here. I think these big fish are going to move up in this shallower water, and we'll, we'll catch a, a real nice one. But can't complain. We'll catch three or four pounders, just giving them sniffs and kisses out here on Jimmy's, Jimmy's big old lake. Parker right here, come back after we have a little bite to eat. Little locale bluebell. <laughs> <laughs> like your style. So far, y'all, the action has been really good. And it seems like these fish are wanting it on the swim. And I can't remember right, the last time I've caught so many fish. I mean, both this lake and the lake we're fishing today, swimming the jig it's not like they're hitting it as it's on the bottom you're having to crawl it they're, they're wanting it kind of moving but one there's one more thing we need in this in this video today and this is just a personal awesome thing for me to to remember forever i want to sniff a bass with jimmy while he's kissing a bass that is just uh dream come true type stuff get a you know get a photo on the wall get him to sign it sort of thing so got to go do that and that is the ultimate like button smash it, it, it has already been awesome just being here but oh man if we can do that let's go see what old lucy thinks about it so far see what she thinks the weather conditions are going to bring judging by the deer's actions right now the ones i've seen they're all bedded up so i hope the bass aren't doing the same We're gonna go catch some more bass, okay, Lucy? 
You good with that? Okay, round two with Jimmy. After lunch. The after, after lunch, lunch special. There's something we got to do. I need I need this photo for my house. We uh, have to I, keep yeah. a couple of five pounders. Five pounders sounds good. A couple of five pounders and take a nice photo. A sniff and a and a kiss. Sniff and a kiss. Oh my. <laughs> I'll put that over the nightstand, you know. Put it my, in your bedroom. Yeah. yeah. Can't get any better than that. <laughs> when you get 100,000 subscribers on YouTube, which is very... It's, it's pretty soon. Out. It's not too far it's gonna away. It's going to happen we're, on this we're video. A little bit over 90, we're a little bit over 90,000 right now. All right. And when we have 100,000 on YouTube, we're going to draw a, a coupon out, and we've got a name and number for everybody's coupon in a big golden ha hopper. I always wanted a golden hopper. I have a golden hopper. And uh, we're going to draw that out. We're going to draw, of our people, one for YouTube and one for our Facebook followers. And they will win a trip here to fish with me uh, on this lake. They can bring a friend. They can bring their wife, their kids, uh, their boyfriend or girlfriend, whatever. They, they can bring one person with them, and we'll fish here on, on the ranch. They need to send, a, send their name and city and state. We don't need their address. Like, uh, you know, Joe Jones, Muskogee, Oklahoma. Text that to our pecan phone number, which is uh, the order we take our pecan orders on in November. He also Special has pecan phone. farm. Here. Yeah, 580-618-7260. And if you have an email address and you want to give it to us, you can put that email address down. And then when we hit 100,000, we're going to draw the winner out. And one, the red coupon, one of them for YouTube, and a blue coupon, one for Facebook. And then win a fishing trip right here. Okay. Chance of a lifetime. I already saw the, what do you call it, the golden... The golden uh, hopper. The golden hopper. Golden hopper. I already saw it. It's a they real need to thing. Subscribe, don't it? So it subscribe. Down link down below. You can go check out Jimmy's channel, and subscribe and sign up, and you can you can come out you here too. You can come and fish right here with Jimmy. Oh, get one. You got one. Oh, what have you got? And a healthy one. Yeah, nice one. Nice fish. Oh, that's going to be a big one of the day. First one of the afternoon. Yeah. Healthy, healthy, healthy. That's the way to start the afternoon off right there. First bite of the afternoon. Dandy. That was a crappie. crappie. Yep, black crappie. See, this is what I like about Jimmy Houston. I fish with other people. I get a crappie bite. They're like, ah. <laughs> Me, and Jimmy, we're turning the boat around. Yeah, you can get the crappie jig for a second. Oh, oh, yep. Crappie bite. Little crappie nibble right there. Yep. Oh, come off. There. Getting a little snippy. <laughs> kind of like those bass. Got him. Got that one. There we go. There we go. Beautiful! Not bad. Hey, hey, hey. Best ways in the world to find and catch a mess of crappie. <laughs> get one to hit a bass bait. Get one to hit a bass bait. And, and looky there. Look at that pair. Look at that pair, will you? Look at that. Yeehaw! <laughs> there you go. All right, little crappies. There you go. See you later. That's, that's not what I'm Beautiful crappies. Pretty good chunk. Oh, yeah. Pretty good chunk. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, come up here in this boat with me. Mmm, nice one. Come up here with me. That's the best one I've caught all day. Oh 
my gosh, hit it on top. Oh, come off. Oh, Jimmy, no. Ate it on top, burning that swim jig. That was a good one. I bet it could have been the same one. Oh, yeah. Man, it ran halfway across the pond. That was scary. Oh, there's another one. Oh, yeah. Ooh. You always land the small one, lose the big one. I think that's a few people. Fun nonetheless. Oh gosh! Oh. Uh -oh. That one ate it on top too, in the dirt. I think so. Oh yeah, nice fish. Oh yeah. Rock on. In the dirt, baby. Oh yeah. Oh, it's down. Down the hatch. That's what I'm weighing. It is. That's what I'm talking about. That's one of them sugar buggers. Dang, you got off. Maybe not. Swim jig bass. Man. <laughs> what you that like? That is cool. That That's is cool. It. That's it. That eight, that that eat was just like the ones on your spinner bait. It was up yeah. on the top, yeah. and it was like it was and so exciting. And he's winding fast. Oh, he pulled off right there. I saw him. I saw him. I saw him close up. <laughs> caught. Caught. That was a little one. All right, y'all. Just switched up my jig trailer to a little chartreuse color, chartreuse pepper, and I'm just swimming this like a spinner bait. I saw Jimmy catch him. Um, waking his spinnerbait on the surface and they were eating it like a top water so I just put on a little bit bigger trailer on this quarter ounce and started reeling it on top and I've had two top water strikes on it one being a really good one so that's just fun times just reeling it in and getting bopped oh god Big one ate it right there. Oh man. Oh goodness. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good fish. Oh man. Oh goodness. Let's see if I can. Oh. Woo! I'll take some more of that. What was that order number? So on rigging this swim jig. Extremely simple, but there's two plastic keepers on this hook shank right here. And for the crack and craw, which puts out a ton of vibe, it's gonna lift your jig a lot. So just be mindful of that. If you want uh, to get it down a little deeper, you would put a more subtle plastic on there, but taking that top section off, feeding it through, coming straight out the top, get it on both plastic keepers. Be sure to separate those tails. And this is just black and blue, which I really just throw black and blue or uh, some sort of like green pumpkin color, usually white in the fall, but usually a darker color in the springtime. And then I just had a wild hair and threw a little chartreuse on there. It actually looks really, really good in the water. It pops. Those tails kicking. So these fish are just coming up on top of the water and eating it like they would on a you know, a topwater buzz bait or something like that, or the way Jimmy's waking that spinner bait. <laughs> oh gosh! Oh jeez! Look at that streamer. Little one. Woo! He had me all over. You know they're not hitting spinner New spot. It's too big. We're gonna stop at a little uh, little hump here real quick. Break out a jig, give it a dangle. Yep. Nope, not a begging. 
dragging a jig back there. I thought that was how that big one was gonna latch on. Got him. It's a good one. Good one right there. Get him out here in the open. He's gonna come out here in the open. What you, what you, oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's oh. a big one. Good fish. I'm waiting on that one. It's look at the belly on that fish. Oh, it's a fat one. Yeah. yeah. Yes, Ooh, mercy me, sugar bugger! <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Look at that belly, man. Yeah. That's a gorgeous one. That's a fiber. Oh yeah, without a doubt, maybe six. Nice. Yeah. On a jig, finally. Tony and give him the card so he has the shot. As long as that's okay. okay with me. Oh! No. Oh no. Don't line, the line don't break. That's a good one. He is a nice one. He is a nice one. Yeah, baby. What a way to end the day. Woohoo, Jimmy! He there. He there. Oh, look at that big mouth. Oh. That big body. Woo! We'll take a really Won't nice Won't that oh, be yeah. sweet? Those are about the same size. I know. They're, that, that one is just all belly. The belly on that critter. Getting late in the day, folks. Uh, we've got a couple of couple of juicies in the well. You know, we're gonna get that legendary picture. It's just been an incredible day. And I caught a big one on Jake. Yeah. I don't know what to say, y'all. Dream, dream come true out here. Fish with Jimmy. Being on the boat with Pat, the man behind the the whole entire masterpiece. 27 years. So I'm just honored. Truly honored. All right, look at these <laughs> pigs, y'all. Those are some beauties. Look at the bellies on those boogers. Jimmy just caught Sugar another booger. fat one. Uh. Sugar boogers, and we're going to let them go here. I thought it would be an amazing shot just to get a sniff and a kiss. Oh, and Jimmy, I got to take, take my hat off and get a little, <laughs> I got to get a little Jimmy going on here. There we go. There we go. All right. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, here we go. <gasps> ah. Yeah, little tongue, little tongue. <laughs> All right, let's put these let babies these baby back. dolls back. Yeah. See you, big one. You got it, dude. Good Jimmy, day. Enjoyed it. Appreciate Jimmy, it. I owe you a huge thank you, not just for today, but for leading the way in the industry. Oh, thank you. And paving a path for for guys like me that just want to try to be like you. you well, I got to I mean? tell you, you do an awful good job at it. You do an awful good job. Thank Been you. a lot of fun out here today. And we will do this some more. Okay. We fished pretty well together. I think so. He didn't get hung up too much today, and I didn't get hung up today, too much today, and I think he appreciated that. Yeah. I know I appreciate him not getting hung up too much. I know. I know how it is. <laughs> well, we, uh, we caught 44 this morning. I think we're at 38. So what would it be, 82? Oh, okay. 82. Even better. Even you better. You got to catch more than you're old. Well, I got. I, if, we, I if, we fish, if we was fishing with Roland, we'd have to catch a few more in Bill. <laughs> Lord, I apologize. Gotta love it. Ah! Gotta love it, guys. Thank you so much yes. for tuning in today. Make sure to go subscribe to Jimmy down below, and you got to smash that like button for greatness. God bless. We'll see you.